But as Charles would say, another day, another soul to save. These people have no idea what they're up against. We really had no idea what we were walking into. If I had taken the threat seriously, then you might be alive. All that matters now is that you give me my ascent. You aim for the heart. I'll destroy the roots. They never learn, do they? Watch out. Spectre position. the sanctity of marriage. Esther wouldn't dare. And we don't need a piece of paper to keep us together. I, I remember you telling her. We were so in love. We are in love. With no condition. To the very end. Aye. The very end. Anybody home?
Esther. Murray? Are you... Are you a dream? Are you here? Are you really here? I am. We are. Have you been here alone all this time? No. Not alone. Charles visits from time to time. We talk. That's not Charles. Charlie had his ascent. Do you remember? Oh, yes. I remember. It's all very foggy. Do we ever mend the wounds of true love lost? Esther, do you know me? Antea? Yes, I know you. You come to Red as Charles comes to me. How very good of you. Dearest Esther, I died. I am a ghost. You know, I'd have liked to join your games. You three, chasing ghosts and whatnot. I learn fast. But not today. Today feels like a dream. What's happened to New Eden while we were gone? Oh, everyone left. I did not wish to join them. She let me stay. She? Deborah? Speak not her name. It makes her angry. She is much more powerful now, and your return has already vexed her. We're here for Antea's body. This is her tie. And the nightmare has it. Yes. By her body, she is held hostage. Her flesh is her tie. Charles told me all about it. We must break the tie to set Antea free. She won't surrender it. You'll have to end her. But if she goes, then Charles goes too. I don't want that. I don't want that at all. What's going on up at the meeting house? I do not ask about the meeting house. And nor should you. To think that once we worshipped there, that Charles would give his sermons there. There of all places. Goodbye, Esther. Perhaps we'll meet again. Perhaps we shall. It's so very pleasant to speak to new old friends from time to time to time. Breaks my heart to see her this way. She talked about a hate, fast growing and deeply rooted. The meeting house will be less than welcoming.
After this, we should set sail somewhere warm and safe. The dead don't linger. <laughs> no such place. But it's not a bad idea. What shall I say to you when I give you your assent? I don't know. All ghosts linger for a reason. It is time. You still have something to say to me, don't you? I told you to be cautious, yet you walked straight into her trap. It was my greatest mistake. And I'll carry it my whole life. And dear, I am sorry. I'm sorry too. This is an odd kind of homecoming. It is strange to be back. It is strange to sleep near the place where you died. Still, rest you should. You'll need it. I don't know that I can. Is it because of what we talked of earlier? What will I say to you when you go? Can I really give you your assent? When the moment comes, you'll know what to say. I'll be the banisher, bringing an ending to his own haunting case. Huh? How does that work? The same as any other. You'll undo the tie. Don't worry. I won't resist. And the reason your ghost lingers is resentment. I'm right, aren't I? That night in this room, I told you to be careful. I worried you'd act rashly and I told you not to. I thought you'd gone to the meeting house without me. I died to save you. The anger lingers. Part of me resents you yet. For my pain and my fear. For my suffering. For my dying. I resent you. And they are. I am truly sorry. I know you are. You've done your best to put things right. But I did die. And in a few short hours, you will have to let me go. This on for size.
she won't let us in so easily. A few roots will not stop us. Suffers. You don't we want suffer. The My friends, I have disturbing news. Among us walks a witch. Is that not so, Deborah Comenius? Lock her up. No, no, tis not true. I am no witch. So that's how it all began. Aye. With ordinary evil from the hearts of fearful men. Deborah Comenius, this court finds you guilty of the devil's work. Guided by God's mercy, I pass sentence on the witch. Pain forted you. Confess and name your accomplices, or die for your sins. I have nothing to confess. How could they have let this happen? Not a soul stood or spoke for her. There's no justice here. It's a travesty. Well done. None stand for you. Your coven has betrayed you. Name them, and you shall live. I am no witch. You know this, all of you. Do not turn away from me. You must release me. You must. Will no one speak for me? Anyone? Please, help me. Help me! I feel her distress. Her rising terror. Her dark despair. She suffered enough. And so have we.
Here, my body, my flesh displayed like a trophy. More like bait. So, the circle is complete. Do you return to the beginning? Or is it the beginning of your return? A paradox. How clever. How it pleases you to play with time. I do not play. Deborah, we know what happened to you. We know what they did to you. What they did. What they do. I shatter yet. We're not here to hurt you. You have my body and I want it back. That's all. Help us. Because we can help you. No, you cannot. Enough. You are me. Yet you oppose me. They murdered us. Make 
make them pay. No. They do not deserve our rage, not these two. Oh, we deserve our wrath. They crushed the breath from us. You know this. You asked for this. It's over. You have been heard. The truth is out. No! Come back! Feed upon the pain, the treachery, the outrage! No more. It hurts. <sighs> Behold my wrath! Remember the bite of the chains!
Enough pain now. There must be a reckoning. The pain may end right now. The reckoning is here. Spare me your compassion, for it comes far too late. Who are you? I am retribution. A word. An idea. But who are you? I am her fury. No longer. I am their nightmare! You were. You believe you've won. It will not be so easy. For I will end your dreams. Is that an end to it? Yes. If you want it to be. Are you sure? In your hand, you weigh my death. The last stone laid upon my broken body. I'm so very sorry. Will you leave? Are you ready? I have lingered so very long. Where now will I go? I don't know. A better place, I believe. A quiet place. Quiet is good. Deborah Comenius, mere words can ill describe your suffering. And if they could, I'd not utter them now. Enough wrong has been done you. Your tale is told, and we thank you for it. You are hurt, and free to go. Hey, I'm right here. Aye, you are. This is unfair. Yet here we are. What am I going to do? It's her I had died, not you. Either way, we must part. I love you so. <laughs> you were the love of my life. 
stay just a little longer. You promised you'd let me go. Maybe we could no. just... No. Stay, please. Don't do this. I can't stay. You know I can't. My one and only love. Thank you. Farewell. I wish I could tell you that time heals all, but that would be a lie. There are already too many lies to this tale. New Eden never recovered. Neither did Ruri Macraith. Guilt does not always lessen with time. Some wounds never close. Some scars remain tender, but who knows? Perhaps someday, a grey-haired Scot may sail to Cuba and tell the Duarte family of their daughter's death and of her greatness. Perhaps he may even admit that he misses her and will miss her his whole life long. <laughs>